<laughs> hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. Alright, quickly then. Let's head to the Chard Hack. Is that as fast as you can run, Naloth? You know, you remind me somewhat of myself, but when it comes to running, I don't think we can compare. Greetings, Master Nellar. I hope this is important. I am Salsas. What? Norman of Tel Sul. Master Sul told me a great deal about you. Who? Oh, him. May I ask what it is you're doing? I was originally on my way to see Master Ren. Met my friend here on the way, and I've been traveling with them since. So I suppose they are the one to ask. It's been some time since I was last in Lothanis. Why? Did something interesting happen? Master Sul was assassinated. More like Tom. Dead? Well, that's annoying. Although, from all indications, he could have proved a serious so... Your compassion is greatly appreciated, Neloth. I can tell you are truly heartbroken at this revelation. Sul, in fact, has some choice words for you if I ever ran into you. Red, when this is over, you'll have to tell me about it. This being? First, it's Ash Spawn attacked. Then my home with us. Almost like someone was out to get me. The great Master Neloth has enemies. I never would have thought it. I'll take my leave then. Perhaps we speak again once you have your problems sorted out. <laughs> well, I'm glad to see you made a proper introduction. I knew the two of you had things in common. All right. Let's go. He's impatiently waiting. So as you can see, Nilor, I've freed the stone over here. I'm not sure which one it was, but it's been freed. Who are we missing? Zavok? What? Alright, we'll just have to go on without him. Our host is getting tired. These towers have outlasted them. The book is housed inside that room. I need to unlock the door once. Let's get on with it. Yes, please. All right. Oh, we have enemies. <laughs> Get them. Kill them all. Fire ice at me. And live to tell about it. I'd <laughs> certainly not you. Hmm. They're actually hurting me.
Look out. That's all. Finish him there. I think that's it. Hmm, so have we really lost Zavok? How disappointing. Maybe somehow he was recalled to oblivion. All right, Nalor. Here we are, the Chardak. Yes. The we're after this right inside that dome. Shall we get off with it? We shall. The Dwemer of Nachardak appear to have been fond of these control pedestals. Luckily, I found a cube to operate it inside on my last visit. I sealed the door when I left to keep out ignorant meddlers. Let me unlock it. The book is just inside. Very well. Sealed, I see. So tantalizingly close. But trust me, no magic will open that. I'd have had the book already if it could. I'm sure. So what's our next no, move? No, we'll have to do this the hard way. If we can restore the steam supply to this room, I'm certain I can open it. As you'll see, that's easier said than done. This way, to the boilers. Follow me. Everyone? Ah, oh, he went on ahead. Let's go. The last time I was here, I only explored a small part of the ruins. I was here alone then, and I found an assistant is absolutely essential for this kind of dirty, dangerous work. Oh, I bet you do. Far be it from you to get your hands Chark, dirty. The city of a hundred towers. In its day, it was the largest of the great Dwemer archives, and perhaps the most advanced. In the old stories, when the Nords came to conquer it, it said that Dwemer submerged the entire city beneath the sea until the invaders gave up. I have my doubts, but the city was a marvel of Dwemer engineering. Now reduced to this. As you can see, most of the lower levels of the city are flooded, but it isn't hopeless. The old Dwemer pumps still seem to work. Watch. They are very clever. Something's triggered my objects. Yeah. What? Provide steam to the room upstairs. All right, I'm sorry, They're I was distracted. Down, but they still respond to the con arcane weapon. Oh, cubes. So, if we can find four more cubes, we can turn these boilers back on and restore steam power to the room upstairs. Then I should be able to open the book's protective case. Bring that cube. We'll need it. This way. Yes. Here we are. This device shows the location of four more cubes in this section of the city. It looks like most of the cubes were moved to the lower levels, perhaps to try to control the flooding before the city was abandoned. Interesting. That would suggest that the city must have originally sunk during the first cataclysm of Red Mountain. Or that the Dwemer's servitors continued to try to preserve the city after their creator's disappearance. I see you enjoy Three of the cubes talking. are through here. This seems like a sensible place to start. 
You should be able to unseal this door with the control cube I gave you. What's going on? We're lucky that the Daedric Princes are no preoccupied fighting amongst themselves rather than uniting against us. All right, it's not that we truly need him with our power. These must be the great workshops of Nacharlak. Look at this, Moa. Even in ruins. More ghosts. The city's days of glory. It was reputed to be able to assemble a complete autonomy. Think of them. Much of the Dwemer's army, the Battle of Red Mountain, must have come from here. That's it. Good work. And I suppose you want me to place the key. Look. All right. Is that thing going to I come believe these to pillars life? will activate the pumps for this room, assuming they. Ah, oh, good. Now we can see if we can find a way to get that next cube. Do I need to put a pedestal ah, here to? What does this one do? Hmm, a staircase. The general philosophy of House of Edmund seems to be that suffering builds character. I'm just not sure they know when to stop suffering. I think we we'll need to re-flood this area to get through it. Come on. I think we're supposed to go on to the other side. Zell's as.
Right, I've got another. What? Good work, Atom. Let's see where this leads. All right. I think we need to take this other cube over here. All right, this way. Water level this high, we can swim across the collapsed part of the passage and reach the other side. <laughs> All right, this My ears didn't what? deceive me. Look out. Destroyed. Now, what do we have here? Right, I have four cubes. I was rightfully on a left. It looks like it's this way, people. You need to start fighting that thing. How can you fight it in the water anyway? They're not listening to you, Nailov. I guess I'll have to destroy it myself. All right, is it isn't four all we needed, or are there more? Let's go. Back. You'll need to lower the water level before we can proceed any further. Very well. I wonder if the soul used to power to our automaton has an impact on the sinking process. The last cube is somewhere through the northern door. We won't be able to open this until the water level is lower. This way. It was named the Calling. Supposedly allowed them to communicate with each other using their minds. Not completely unheard of. Our Sargonians possess something similar. There's something here. Come out, this is 
and I'm not able to use my magics. Interesting. Interesting, I can't raid there. Now I can use my magics. All right, let's go. Guardian, I take it as yours. Guess that must be the pump activator up there. But how to reach it? We'll need to get all three of these bridges down in order to reach the pump control. They I are very blind in the water. Takes care of the Ash Guardian. Wait, who? Just as long as that's not one of my people floating out there. All right, let's get moving. We're wasting time here. Oh, more of these switches. Hmm. So I think we're just going to have to try one at a time. All right, so that lowered that gate. Uh oh. These things seem to be an endless supply. I've got it. Well, maybe I didn't. Something like a try attack. It does take a bit of my magicka though. What is going on? Is I thought these were new laws. Someone finish it. Okay, well. Insist. Thank you. We'll need to get all three of these bridges down in order to reach the pump control. Well, this might not be as easy as you think. Where? I think I have another cube. That went back up. And that went back up. Wait, didn't we? Hold on. Well, that's progress of a sort, but we'll need all three down at once to get to the pump. All right, Nailov. Oh, 
I see. So that one. Bear with me, people. Puzzles were never my strong suit. So it should be the middle one then. No, not no. I think that's that did it. it. Don't touch anything else. Quickly now. I like how you just stand around, Naloth, and order us about. <laughs> that's all right, though. I still like you. Hmm. Now which way? Apparently not this way. I suppose we're jumping down. How? away behind that gate let's see here I might have an answer for this or not No, it's filling up with water. Let's go. Do you have the cube? Good, good. Then I'll take this cube and we can be on our way. Watch out. Water's rising in half when we can't shut down. That was easier than I expected. I'm glad you were here to do all the hard work. Oh, I bet you With were. If I retrieve from the pumping pedestal, we should now have five cubes, exactly what we need. Now we can finally see about getting those boilers started. All right. 
right. Do we go back the way we came? You're not being helpful, Naloth. It's below. Hmm, one handed attacks, interesting. All right. Yes, water breathing. I thought I had this in my arsenal. I expected a lot more water. I suppose I didn't need the spell. <laughs> All right, let's go. Can't sneak up on me. Do you mean to be the same house to Marduk? Interesting that lightning doesn't seem to affect them. Machines. Whatever. You'll need the cube I picked up to start all the boilers. Well, thank you at least for your minor contribution. All right, so we have two. You'll need the cube I picked up to start all the boilers. Wait a minute, how is this going to work? You'll need the cube I picked up to start all the boilers. That's this one, right? I picked up this cube for you. Thank you. You're too kind. Shall we get on with it? That seems to have done it. Good. It took longer than I thought. But at least it's finally done. No, look what we have here. Take care of it. Or not. They are very clever. Um. All right, so. As much as I hate to admit that. Electricity doesn't affect machines. Switch to ice.
finished. <laughs> Somewhere I read that these things were vulnerable to cold. But they really should be vulnerable to electricity. I suppose I'll give it a rest. What's this out here? Now that the boy knows how one of the things look for simple to release the book from its protective case. All right. You're babbling. I'm no one's paying back attention. And see if the reading room has steam. So, it should be a simple matter to release the book. All right then, let's go. We were wasting time. All I want to do is confront Mirak. To think that I have to go through all this. Ooh. You'd think with the intelligence and industry of the Dwemer, they'd find a way back by now. Are you coming? Oh, well, look who joined us. Zavok. Oh, okay, here he comes. I was going to say, don't don't tell me we've got you at the expense of Naloth. Here we go. Oh, what? Well, all right. I suppose I'll have to pull it myself. your assistance, Neeloth. Don't worry, now, I'll take careful notes of what happens to you. Please. All right, it's time to read the Black Book.